Every ship needs a sailor Or who's going to row Every note a mailer Each dead man a ghost Go run, tell your neighbors They're missing the show Let in some fall You clap if we call You dial up your folks Steady as she goes to the main radio How are I'm you? So sorry, I thought I read that it's I was okay. Three PSC. I know. I was like taking a nap too. <laughs> you know what? I called it. I'm like, you know, I should probably have a little nap. I'm so sorry. Yeah, no, it was my bad. I like read it. I, I'm sorry. It was my fault completely. How's your week been? It's been good. Yeah. It's been good. It's been. I've got. I've been getting a lot of rest at night, which I usually haven't been doing. Yeah. Yeah. So it's been. It's been good. I've been playing music and mm. just you know staying afloat yeah i'm so glad you agreed to do this because i mean people watching this um will know that we've done this before and yes you know i had some mess ups on my end and now we get to do it again i so, know now mess ups on my end <laughs> now I'm like, no, it's it will fine. edit that part out girl it's yes. fine <laughs> <laughs> um yeah because i mean guess we'll touch base on a few things we talked about already um because i think you have such an interesting story and um i definitely want to touch base on the whole i mean you are you are you are a night owl usually you're yes, up I playing am. all night and this is because i mean you stream for a living basically yes i do yeah i've been streaming for i've been streaming for for about four years in the beginning i was streaming video games before i was doing music and then uh yeah, I just, I, once I started doing music, it's just, I don't know, like, it's just been something that has been really cool, you know, to do because I've been able to connect to people from around the world and also yeah. like make a living out of it and also practice from my own home, you know, so <laughs> I've been, you know, and also like being a self-taught musician, like streaming has really helped me, yeah. you know, because, because uh, I'm just home and I'm already playing music and it's just nice to to feel that somebody wants to join me in that process and also support yeah. and believe in me and, you know, build an organic uh, following. Yeah. Well. And you're, like, you're already in your comfort zone. So how much better could you get, you know? It, yeah. I feel like it's for sure. Like, a I, it's, it's, I, I feel very blessed about it. Yeah. You know, like I feel very grateful that I have something cause I'm a, I'm an, I'm also an introvert. So I like staying <laughs> home and I'm like, I can work from home. Yes. Thank you. And it's normal by everyone. Yeah. Yeah, it is. It is. It's really, it's yeah. Yeah. I feel really, again, really grateful for it. Yeah. One thing I didn't ask you though, before was what kind of video games were you playing? Like, what are your favorites? <laughs> I was playing a lot of first person shooter games. So a lot of like oh. Call of Duty, Battlefield, uh, I mainly sniped. I liked the sniping on it. So I was <laughs> really, I got killer. really, I got, yeah, I was just, I, I was just really into um, killing people, you know? I feel like there was a part of me that really wanted to do that and video games just gave me that outlet. A legal outlet. Yeah, yeah. exactly. How can you play the harp in jail? Yeah, like, you know? yeah. I mean, I feel like music has for sure taken that side of me. Yeah. Like just like all of my mo because I think that with video games because video games was the first thing I think in my life that really allowed me to like escape reality because I didn't really know how to channel emotions or really you know I didn't know how to connect with myself so it was for mm. sure you know a way for me to get a lot of anger out and I think that's why like even now I don't really play any video games because I don't know like now I just play music and it, yeah. it's just because I'm able to really, you know, emotionally get out all the frustration that I had, yeah. uh, I think that music has really helped. And oh. video games were first, but I think it was only anger that was kind of <laughs> anger and like competitiveness and mm. all that, you know, like it just, uh, so now music, yeah, music yeah. is what I mean. I guess the video games kind of set you up to like learn the streaming at least and all the things you have to do. Cause I mean, even your videos, it, it's, it's easy to just, you know, put up on your phone and yeah. go live, but it does make a difference when you have good sound, you have a mic, you have the proper lighting. Yeah. Um, those things, it does take practice and learning over yeah. time. 
Yeah, and like a lot of investing. I actually just bought myself a camera to get an what? HD. Yeah, I'm gonna be having a even crisper. Oh yes. Today. I'm so excited about it. Yeah, and it's yeah, I don't know. It's just it's it's been it's been a lot of fun. It's yeah, been a lot so of fun. That's usually me. I'm like, oh like, to is stream it be and just <laughs> Yeah, like it's just been I I love I love, I love streaming. Yeah. Uh, we love that you love streaming because we love your videos. You're definitely, I told you this last time, but you're definitely one of my favorites. I am just so in love with your music and your energy. And, um, you know, you can tell this is something, I mean, before I didn't know this is what you did for a living, but yeah. as a musician or something, maybe because you've been around a lot of people when you're playing, you're just so good at engaging with them. It's like, it's like you're actually on stage or in a room with them and it's not just, you know, people writing comments. Yeah. Um, well, I think it, that's for sure like the beauty of it. And that's why I think I really loved, you know, what you did with like Socially Distant Fest. It's just like you, you, you gave musicians a platform to really see that. Because like in the other platforms that I stream on Twitch, like it, it's mainly for video games and music has just became a thing. Yeah. So I think that it was really cool that you guys started this group because I think music live streaming, when it came to music, there wasn't really anything on Facebook for it. And I think that this group really gave people that, you know, that, I don't know, like that push that they wouldn't normally do it. Yeah. So it's really exciting to see so many musicians streaming music online. Yeah. And just, you actually, sorry, you actually have no, to no, like, no. um, compete with space online now. It's like, you know, trying to book a show and not around another show and not pick the same night. And now it's like, okay, this guy is streaming at this time. So I got to wait. It's crazy. Yeah. And it's, this is the future, you know, this is, we are living in our internet. <laughs> we never leave here now. We live here now. I know. I love it. I love it. I don't have to leave my house. Yes. 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 Please. Yes. Yeah. Um, yes. What are your, what are your musical influences? Because I know um, from our speaking last time is the harp wasn't what you started with. No, no, it was a good, it's a guitar. I've been playing the guitar for longer. So I've been playing the guitar for five years. I've been playing the harp for two and mm -hmm. it's just, I don't know. I, for the harp, I don't really have any influence. Like not, any anyone that I watch um, play the harp, other than uh, my one friend, her name is Zerafina. She's beautiful. She's a beautiful harpist, and I've seen her play live for the first time, and just that was the first time I ever heard the harp. Well, live, you know, of like yeah. really paying attention to it, and I just remember that initial feeling of just hearing it and thinking about something in my past that happened that I I, I was able to see it in a different light and also feel safe and again just going back to like feeling safe with like my emotions and my thoughts and thinking about things in a different way the harp really made me feel that and so immediately I was like I want to play the harp yeah uh, this is because I, I was getting the goosebumps <laughs> and it's just like these are signs I need to pay attention Aww. to it I think that uh the more you like pay attention to those moments where you really feel like yourself and you feel again just safe yeah. Uh, and comfortable I, I think it's the moments that you're really trying to talk to yourself or tell yourself like this is where you should be or this yeah. is what you should keep doing or oh. you know and I, I really got that with the harp when I first heard it so I just I had to play it so I don't really have any influences um, your own influence and that's good enough <laughs> yeah a little bit yeah a little bit I like it but uh yeah no it's it's just yeah I love the harp yeah I feel yeah. it's so weird because with the guitar it's different because uh, the way the scales are, it's it, it's weird to look at it. But when it comes to the harp, it's easier for me to understand music because I don't know music theory. I mm. just um, go based on sound. And so That's it's easy incredible. for me to recognize patterns when it comes to the harp. So I feel like I'm getting better on the harp than I am on the guitar. It which, seriously looks like you came out of the womb with the harp. So I love yeah, the harp. Yeah. When I, when I, they, you know, I'm still learning so much about the harp. I, I'm actually just, I just started a, a, I just started a fund on my other, on my other streaming channel for a, a bigger harp. Cause everybody's like, you need to get a bigger harp. Cause I have a lap harp. So yeah, so I've been doing it. So I'm excited because I, I think I'm be getting a bigger harp. Oh, that's amazing. And I'm like, ah, yeah, I'm so, I'm, I'm so, I'm so. Okay. Excited. Well, you got to send me that link. Cause I will share it everywhere and uh, we gonna get you a bigger harp. 
I know. Amazing. I'm so excited. They're so expensive, but I'm just, I, I need it. How and much it, is a harp going for? I've never well, the looked one, at that. The one that I'm going to get is about 2,500, which is honestly Damn. not, I mean, the one I really want to get, like the big one, eventually, not even now, because I live in an apartment now and I cannot have a big $17,000 harp in my uh, There's no harp. bed, just harp. Yeah, just a harp. So it, it's 2,500, but, um, but I'm excited. Yeah, bigger than the one I have. So I'm sure the tones are going to be beautiful. And yeah. yeah. Oh, God, that's so cool. Um, yeah. Your your family, uh, how how do they feel about, you know, the whole streaming lifestyle? Because I know there is some. You know, uh, <laughs> well, you know, I, I'm a first generation uh, Mexican, so their view on, you know, success is very, very like academic you know, go to school and like graduate, which again, it's wonderful. It's wonderful if that's like yeah. what you choose, but I just, I never felt really comfortable in school and I didn't, and I always thought that I would, you know, eventually graduate from, you know, I, I wanted to be like a psychologist. I was like doing psychology when I first started um, college, but it just, I got really bored, you know, like I didn't like, I didn't, I don't really like structure. <laughs> and I, I don't, yeah, like I, I, feel I don't. That. I don't I like, like structure no. and I don't like somebody telling me what to do. And I don't like, I just don't like structure mm-hmm. and I don't like schedules either. Yeah. Um, you gotta be here at 7.00 AM or you fail. Like, I, well, I guess I'm failing. Like, uh, sorry. <laughs> yeah. And so I kind of always felt as though I was never, that was never really going to be my path. Mm-hmm. And so my parents, um, they're not, I'm not, I'm not, I don't want to say that they're not supportive because they for sure love me and they, yeah. they, you know, and they believe in me, but it's, it's, it's still something that they don't really see as a, the best career move because yeah. it's not stable. It's not secure. I don't, you know, there's, there's no set plan. There, there isn't, there's nobody in the family that's also done it. There's nobody in my family that's an artist or that's doing this. So, Interesting. so it's hard for them to really conceptualize it and really um, just understand. Yeah. But I, uh, I, 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 I don't know. It's a, li- it's a little <laughs> sad for me sometimes because mm. um, especially when it comes to music, I, it, it, I'm so very, very passionate about it. And for, to know that there's still like a little bit of disappointment for me not graduating school or for me not, doing you know what they believe is best for me is 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 a little you know disheartening but in you know I I feel like there's just some sacrifices that you need to take especially when it's something that you love and I love music and and I just I want to keep doing it so that one day that you know they can really see you know that this is just something that I love to do and and I wonder if they'll think differently after all this you know because everyone's online people are making crazy amounts of money online yeah. um, and even before this people were making money online but yeah. I wonder if they'll see like do, are do they have Facebook are they, yeah, they online have yeah have they, they have. seen some of your videos and the interaction you get and the oh. reach you get oh yeah they they do they yeah. do and uh and like I said they they love me they're the no oh, matter yeah. what I do like I'm their daughter and it, but they're it, again, like it just goes back to them really wanting me to have like an education and like yeah. just have a secure because they just they wanted me to think more about my future and to be like, is, you know, is this really something that you're going to do? Because I mean, I originally had left college because I was like, I'm dropping out because I'm going to go play video games. Like that was like, because <laughs> I started doing music by, yeah, in 2015. So it wasn't, it's like, it's almost like brand new con- thing for them to be like, oh, well, now you're doing music and I'm going to do video games anymore. So it's just, for them, it's just like, I'm just, mm. you know, going on this roller coaster and they're just trying to catch up with me. Yeah. But with music, Aww. it's different. Yeah, with music, it's different and I love it and they love me. So I know that eventually they're going to come gonna, around. They're coming around. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not bothered by it. Like I'm, I, I'm no longer like living at home with them. So, you know, I've, I've been independent for, four years now you know so it's, yeah, it'd be it's, different if you were like still in their basement and you play yeah and I'm games. just like mom I'm doing video games it's like, no it's like I moved out like without necessarily a plan I'm like I need to do this you know yeah. so 
it, I, I think that it's just about taking bold moves and really believing and um again like my parents love me and they I know that there's always a home for me you know there and I always feel safe and good there so it, it, it might not be exactly how they pictured my life to be but uh <laughs> I'm sure that there. I'm sure that I'll change their mind one day which would be great. <laughs> I think you're doing fantastic I just um, I mean, success looks so different for, for everybody, right? And that could be monetary or, you know, just being able to do what you love for the rest of your life. And um, I think the way you're doing it is definitely in what I'm in alignment with. And I think um, you're happy you're doing what you love and yeah. uh, don't ever stop that. Yeah. Whatever feels good, just do it. Yeah. yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. I really appreciate that. What kind of, uh, I mean, what are some things that are goals, but also maybe just things you want to like dip your toes in one day? Oh, um, I for sure want to go on tour. I mean, I, of course, right now it's not yes. that big, but I do. I want to travel. I really want to just travel and play music around the world mm. because be, be, because of streaming, you know, I am able to move around if I want to because I work yeah. from home. So I do see myself like every six months, like living somewhere, That'd be you so know, and crazy. like streaming. <laughs> I'm just like just taking, and it's so on the that's beach now. Nobody it's like it. really going with that like vagabond mentality, mm. you know, because I already kind of have it in me of like the just that spirit of not necessarily again. Like I hate structure and I hate. I don't know. I love patterns. Don't get me wrong. I love patterns, but I I like making my own you know yeah I think that like I like being uncomfortable yeah you know, not really knowing what's gonna happen <laughs> <laughs> which isn't again it's not the great it's scary it's scary but it's it's for sure very worth it and yeah. beauty comes out of that because you're yeah. forced to um think and innovate and try new things it's like uh, I don't know how I'm going to feed myself or my family this week so what mm -hmm. am I going to do this week to, you know, try something yeah. new or whatever? So yeah, it's good. Just living in the moment. Yeah, for sure. Um, who have been some of your um, top, I mean, I don't want to say favorite, but maybe like top performers in the group, other people that maybe you would even reach out to like collaborate with or something. Um, I, I don't want to mess up his name. He plays <laughs> sitar though. The, the sitar? Yeah. Is it, I don't even know how to properly say it. I'm just guessing. Yeah, I'm going to say an and. I believe it's and. An, an and or anand. Yes. And yes. I'm going to say an and, I think it yeah, is. Yeah, I love the sitar and I love tablas. And uh, so I would for sure would love to play some music with him. Oh my God, he'd be so down for that. He is I the know, sweetest the, human. Yeah, he, he seems really sweet and I love his music. And I just, yeah, he's like one of the main ones that I actually do love to watch when he's on. Because I just, I love the sitar. Yeah. I actually have one. What? I have a sitar. Have, a sitar. have you played it in the group yet? <laughs> I haven't played it in the group yet, no. Oh my God. That'll be an amazing day. <laughs> really, it, yeah, it's a little, it's one of those instruments. It's, a, it's yeah, it's, it, you need to get acclimated with that thing. Because <laughs> it's so huge. So you have to pull yeah. it in. But it's beautiful. It's a beautiful instrument. So I've been watching him a lot because I do have a sitar. So I've, I've been learning from watching, uh, watching him play. You know, um, he's actually helping um, Jacob. Uh, Jacob's the man who like created uh, Socially Distant Fest. And they're just doing like private homie lessons all oh, over the internet. Cool. Yeah, I bet if you reached out to him, he'd be like, like look, I actually have a sitar. What do I, I do? <laughs> <laughs> he'd be like, all right, girl, let's do this. Tell me. He's so down. He's just the sweetest human. For sure. Yeah, that'd be really fun. Do you have any friends uh, in the group playing? I, You know what? I saw one of my friends. Her name's Kelsey Lane. She's a comedian, but she also does oh. music. Do you know who I'm talking about? No, but like we're dying to have comedians in there. Yeah, I know. I'll for sure give her a give her a, um, a ring and I'll tell her about yeah. that because she's really funny and she's so cool and she plays guitar, so she does like funny music oh, on it. Crazy. Yeah, so yeah, I've you gotta her, have her in there. Yeah, I've seen her stream on here a, a couple times. I could tell so, a few other. I have a few other comedian friends, but I'm sure she can bring more because she's actually a comedian from Los <laughs> Angeles. So she oh damn brings everybody from here. <laughs> Yeah. She's serious. Yeah, no, she's yeah. she's so cool. You'd love her. 
Her name's Kelsey Lane. I'm going to yeah. be looking out for her now. Yeah, she's great. Uh-huh. <laughs> well, yeah, we are, we're huge fans of you and we're so grateful to have you as a part of our community and sharing your talents with us. Um, and I can't wait to see just what happens for everybody after all of this and uh, to watch everybody just grow and keep succeeding and kicking yeah. ass at their goals and dreams. Yeah, it's going to be amazing. Thank you yeah. so much for having me again. Yes, thank you for joining me again. Of course, anytime. I know maybe there'll be a, a there'll be another update soon. Hopefully I get to talk to you again. <laughs> yes, that'd be great. I would like to do a follow-up with everyone just hey. to see how everyone's doing. Of course. All right, girl, you have a good night and uh, I'll be too. seeing you. Uh, oh, yes, I always forget to ask. Do you have any, I mean, probably not because we already know you don't like schedules, but do you have any like... <laughs> like set time or day that you like to go live in the group for people to maybe you know actually like going on the live on this uh during the day during the day like if I'm awake during the day because I'm usually sleeping during the day because I'm up at like 10 I I get up like at 10 p.m and then I start (laughs) yeah and then I start streaming but no I don't have a set time for this it's just spontaneous I'm sorry you're gonna have to catch me when I'm when I'm there I'm like <laughs> I know I caught you early one morning I was like this is the best thing ever it was the and best that's just way because to start the I day. didn't sleep at night I was, still <laughs> awake. I was like I'm gonna stream because I am not having fallen asleep and that's when you catch when I'm when I'm streaming in the morning it's because I haven't slept <laughs> and I'm like I'm still up well you still looked great and you played beautifully so thank, thank you so much. I really appreciate it oh, all right lady you have a good night and we will talk soon of course. Thank you so much. Have a Bye. Bye. Go and tell your neighbors they're missing the show. Let in some volume. Clap if we call you. Dial up your folks. 